innovative multi-material concept for automotive seat structures. When it comes to future vehicle seats, the market has two major demands, reduce weight to save on fuel consumption and, at the same time, keep costs reasonable. We at Johnson Controls accept this challenge and invest systematically in new technologies to achieve and protect our competitive advantage. Since 2011, a team of specialists in our technology and advanced development group, T&AD for short, has been working with several partners, including Evonik and RWTH Aachen University in a project called Kamisma, which is funded by the German government. The goal of the Kamisma project was to develop a new technology using carbon fiber reinforced thermoplastics to create an innovative, lightweight multi-material seat structure, a goal the team has accomplished. At the start of the production process, single sheets of carbon fiber reinforced tapes are strategically placed on a sheet of non-woven recycled carbon fibers to ensure that the future seat shell is only as thick as necessary and at the same time as robust as needed. This method allows us to reduce scrap from 50% to 5% compared with hot pressing and this has a positive impact on cost and weight. Using water jet cutting, we shape the layered shell with utmost precision and clean edges. Then, the layup is dried and heated in a special oven to make it formable. After that, the layup is transferred to a mold where metal inserts have already been placed for the later adaption of the recliner. This is where we use injection molding to add the glass fiber reinforced material that forms the reinforcing rib structure and trim channel. This completes the seat back shell. The use of several different types of thermoplastics is possible. During the development process, TNAD and its partners determined the best combination of materials to use. Then, they defined and optimized the dimensions of the parts necessary. Check the results in FMEA simulations developed a tailored multi-material structure, tried it out in a near production process, and finally validated the results in crash simulations. The resulting new technology realizes weight savings of more than 40% in the seat back structure and can be implemented into the first customer applications for model year 2019. The Kamisma project is just one example of the technology advancements achieved by Johnson Controls Technology Group. It shows the company's ability to develop and validate new materials, technologies, and production methods using the capabilities and expertise of TNAD and its network of partners and suppliers to develop differentiating products. This new innovation underlines the leading position of Johnson Controls as a technology company in automotive seating.